بسم اللہ الحمد للہ وسلاۃ وسلام علیہ رسول اللہ انڈرسٹینڈ قرآن اینڈ صلاح دا ایزی وے تھری منٹ سیریز لیسن نمبر ایٹین اے ان وچ وی ول اسٹڈی ادکار آف رکو بائی دا اینڈ آف دس لیسن وی ول لرن سیونٹی ٹو ورڈس وچ اکر آلموسٹ ٹوینٹی فور تھاؤزینڈ فائیو ہنڈریڈ ٹائمس ان دا قرآن ان رکو وی سے سبحان ربی العظیم گلوری بی ٹو مائی لارڈ دا میگنیفیسنٹ Actually, Subhana Rabbi Al-Azim has four aspects. Number one, we say Subhana, which means, O oh Allah, you are free from defects. Rabbi has two parts. You are the Rabb and you are my Rabb. Al-Azim, the magnificent. Subhana, that means my Rabb is not weak, not afraid of anyone, not careless. doesn't get tired or sleep, doesn't do things without purpose, he is not an oppressor or unjust, and so on. He is Rabb, the one who takes care of me and helps me grow because he is my Rabb. The one who controls each and every one of trillion cells and the molecules and atoms inside and who is feeding me every second through oxygen, not just food, and made huge arrangements externally to ensure that I get the food. So when I say Rabbi, I should say it with love and he is Al-Azim, the Magnificent. Azim means the one who is great as well as strong because Azm means bone which shows strength, which represents strength. So Azim, the one who is great as well as strong, the Magnificent. When we stand up from Ruku' we say Sami'a Allahu liman hamida Sami'a listened Sami'a Allahu Allah listened Liman Li is to Man who Liman to the one who Sami'a Allahu liman Allah has listened to the one who Hamida who praised him Hamida praised who him Doesn't Allah listen to everyone? Of course, here it means that a special attention is given to the one who praises him. Allah doesn't need our hamd. It doesn't benefit him at all. He doesn't lose anything if we don't praise him. It is purely for our own benefit. We develop gratitude by praising him and we get rewards by praising him. And after getting up from Ruku' we say Rabbana walaka alhamd Our Lord to you is all the praise Alhamd means all praises and thanks Our Lord to you is all the praise and thanks While saying Rabbana walaka alhamd We can visualize the best qualities of Allah Oh Allah, you are the most merciful, most powerful, best creator, best designer, and so on. Jazakumullah khair, wassalamu alaikum, wa rahmatullahi, wa barakatuh.